What's going on, everybody? All right, today I want to talk about fandoms in general and how the fans and most of it has become toxic. All right. Before we get into it, make sure to hit that subscribe, drop your comments, and let's get into it. All right, look, check this out. All right, every fandom has its good and it always has its bad. All right, look, I'm a Transformers fan, and even within that community, I'm not saying all, but lately it's been happening in there as well as in everything. You have it in Marvel, you have it at DC, you have it in Jurassic Park, you have it in Jurassic World, you have it in Transformers, you have it in everything, all right? Star Wars, everything, all right? You're going to have a group of fans that are always going to support and go with, you know, whatever it was before and, and, you know, stuff like that. So I don't know if it's just because us as humans don't like change or what it is. Maybe it's just people are sometimes stuck and hung on to nostalgia i'm not one that really clings on to nostalgia but if i like it i like it you know if i don't i don't but when it comes down to the fandoms all right i tend to post over at the facebook group you know like on certain uh, groups that i'm in with transformers um the same thing like i was with dc and with marvel and all that stuff and lately within the community of the transformer fans it has gotten to the point where you're like, dude, you're a grown as man and you're talking all this crap about somebody that posts something. Look, all right, l let me just clarify something. This YouTube channel that I have is for everybody and all to enjoy. If you want to go ahead and rant and you want to go ahead and talk good, you want to just express yourself, go for it. That's what I leave it there for, because everybody is entitled to an opinion. But when the opinion becomes an insult or you're offending somebody, I'm not playing that. I'm completely deleting your ass. You know, like I'm either blocking you after several times because I've had enough or just whatever. You just pushed it. So I'm just going to delete your comment. I'm just keeping it real, you know, and if you get out of the line, I'm just going to delete or, or, or just block you. Why? Because I'm not tolerating that. Look. Times are too tough and things are too stressful to be in a fandom that you enjoy, whatever it is, whatever it is that you like, all right, whatever hobby you're there to enjoy, right? And when you have people coming down, just talking in general about anything and trying to offend, I'm not down with that, all right? And it's gotten to a point where everybody now thinks that they can say whatever they want, how they want and get away with it, you know? I guess it's just the spoiled generation, spoiled times that we're living in where people just don't have no no type of, you know, like respect whatsoever, you know, and it's just, yo, if I'm giving you respect, show it back. You get what I'm saying? If you drop a comment and I respond, it's two things. I, I, I probably agree with you or don't agree with you. You know, we're entitled to that, you know, or just I'm just going to keep it real. Sometimes I'm just lazy to respond. But um, most of the time. When people are dropping negative comments, it just gets to the point of like, calm down with that. You know, like we don't need that right now. Just just talk about the fandom, talk about your hobby, enjoy it and just continue. You get what I'm saying? But there's some people, like I said, you know, like I post on on the Transformers uh, forum. I said something the other day just, you know, to see, you know, who can help me out with a question that I had. And you have all these grown ass people just coming down and just trolling and talking all type of smack, you know. And it's like, all right, cool. You got that pre-order that it arrived and, you know, it's good for you. You know, like mine's hasn't. But the point is that sometimes people give opinions when they're not needed and they say things when it's unneeded also, you know, because I can sit here and we can see all these comments. All right. The same as in Twitter, you can see my account and people just love to go on an insult spree. And it just gets overwhelming where it's like, yo, like, I'm not even wasting my time, honestly, because it just takes your energy. It just sucks it. But at the time that everything has come down to is like the, each fandom has its good. But lately, every fandom is getting more and more toxic because you have so many people that are coming in there and just want to talk bad. And I get it. It's not every fandom because you have good and you got bad. But when it's just too much, it's like, yo, chill with that. You get what I'm saying? I don't know. This is just something that's just going through my mind. Drop your comments, hit that subscribe, turn the notification on, and as always, until next time.